I am feeling good. I am hungry. I just ordered so much food. I'm gonna go to a restaurant, pick it up and eat all of it in the car. Just spread it all out and you just kind of look at the street. That's the social distancing that I'm doing, like to keep everybody safe. I, I eat my car and go to restaurants and put it in the car and eat it. <laughs> I honestly was not nervous. I was, I think I was a little cocky. Like, you know, I was kind of like, I got this. I don't get nervous for live TV, I'm good. And then, right when the show was about to start, I started to get nervous. I, I started to get like butterfly and all weird and I don't know what happened. 20, 30 minutes in, I was like, oh my gosh, it's live. I'm, what am I doing? I'm gonna fall, my dress is so big, blah, blah, blah. Like there was a lot going on. I don't know, it actually made them worse because the dress weighed, I don't know, like 80 pounds. It was, the dress takes three people to hold it. It is so heavy and I was sewn into it. So like to change, to get out of it, it's to break the back, you know, like to get out of the dress. So that was part of my nerves actually, <laughs> it didn't help. Speaking to the, the Dancing with the Stars team and the creative director, Justin Mabardi, he's like, he wants Met Ball. We, we want to like take it to the next level. And so we know that a lot of people that will come to the show that are my fans are gonna expect it. And if I didn't bring it, they'd be like, really? So you brought us to Dancing with the Stars, you're not bringing it on the fashion and taking it up 10 notches. It's ballroom time and you gotta go there. Dancing with the Stars and America's Next Top Model, it's two different things. Um, what is very similar is um, a lot of the things that I see the Dancing with the Stars judges saying to the stars are very similar to what top model judges say to the models in the making. It's about presence, it's about commitment, it's about like pushing all the way through. It's about modeling or dancing from head to toe, from fingertips to toes. So all that's very similar. Then there's all this technical stuff. They were talking about a flick and a dick. Uh oh, sorry. No way to flick and a lick or flick and a kick. Oh, oh excuse me. <laughs> So I have a lot to learn when it comes to like ballroom lingo. I am learning a lot. Or like I'll think somebody was perfect and then Derek's like, you didn't point your toes enough. And then I go, you know what? You didn't point your toes enough. So like, I'm learning. He's in that power position, right? He used to be yeah. in front of that desk. Now he's behind it judging. That, is, you know, if I was Derek, I would look at that as like the ultimate come up. Right? So like have been competing and now you're judging. That's like one of my America's Next Top Model girls, you know, like being on the show and now she's telling other models what to do. Like, I, I'm so proud of him. And I also love that he came home. So many people like a place will make them, but they don't like turn around to like recognize that. So I love that he came home. He's like, this place made me and I'm coming home. Love it. It's the, the opening number. Um, well, the opening where Whitney Houston is singing and I get in the car and I turn the ignition on and I'm driving. I did my own hair. I did my own makeup. Um, I didn't style myself, but I had to dress myself that day. So there are a lot of things that are happening um, because you can't necessarily test everybody on certain days. And when you can't test them, they're not allowed on set. And sometimes I have to do my own hair and makeup, but just take packages. You're gonna see another one next week. Did my own hair, did my own makeup. In fact, I couldn't fix my clothes, so I'm kind of leaning on the desk in this, in this like tape package because my clothes look crazy and I didn't know how to fix them. So those are the sacrifices that you know we have to make during this time, during this pandemic, to make sure we can deliver fantastic TV, but keep everybody as safe as possible.